Good morning, everybody. My name is Brian Walters. Uh, for those of you who don't know me, I've been a member here for a little over 15 years now, and I've had the pleasure of serving as the chair of the governing board for the last uh, year and a half. I'm getting ready to just finish my term. I always have to pause for a minute uh, when I'm up here on the pulpit um, because it, it's, it's just awesome. Um, and, and what's awesome about it is, is, is not just this beautiful sanctuary, it, it, it is beautiful. Um, and what's awesome about it is not just thinking about the amazing speakers who have shared this pulpit over the years. What's really amazing about it is looking out at this community and seeing so many friendly and familiar faces that have become a very important part of my life and my family's lives. Being part of this community is why I come to church. When I think about our mission to free the mind, grow the soul, and change the world, we are an independent church, which means there's no money coming from Rome or Washington, D.C., or anywhere else. We're it. And while we get some money from our weddings that we host here and from rentals of the building, the bulk of our money comes from our members. And as I think everybody in the room also knows, and I think this is a fantastic practice, we give 100% of our plate collections on every Sunday to social justice organizations and community organizations. We don't use your Sunday offering unless you designate it to go to the church. Undesignated offerings go back into our community. But that means that your pledge commitment is that much more important in order for us to sustain the operations of the church. I, I can't put a price tag on what this church has meant to me and my family, and it, it, so it's very easy for me to give and to give generously. But I don't just give for myself, and I don't just look at this church through, a, through the, my own personal lens. I also give to the church because there are so many in our church community who give generously of their time and their energy, but are not blessed with the same financial resources that I have. And so to honor their work, to honor what I get and what our community gets from their efforts, I give them my money to help make up for the times that I can't be here to help support their very important volunteer work for our community. Finally, I give on behalf of those who haven't even found us yet, but someday will, because I was there, as we all were at one point. I want to leave you with a quote from Sir Winston Churchill who said, we make a living by what we get, we make a life by what we give.